Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Ooze one more time for you guys. I want to make this last video of the day. As you guys can tell, I'm wearing the same hat and shirt. So yes, I'm recording all these videos back to back to back. And this should be the last one for the day. Now, with that being said, I do want to say that this video is going to be a video not to reveal any kind of spoilers. It might have some minor spoilers because I wanted to address some things as far as my progression with the My Hero Academia manga. So as you might have known from past videos, I have been telling you guys that I do plan on catching up with the manga eventually over time especially before season four starts in the anime next spring now thinking about that and knowing that in my head and for those that remember well, if you don't well now you know i am going to be keeping you guys up to date with what i've been reading so that way you guys know my progression and what i can tell you guys right now and of course i am trying to make this video as short as possible and just to get my point across is that the season that's coming is probably going going to be one of the best seasons that we have seen and i'm just saying that as of right now i haven't read too far into it i know that there's just about over 200 chapters of my hero academia manga and i'm about at chapter 151 just like the first generation of pokemon i'm at one, chapter 151 so that means that i've read literally chapters 124 ish all the way up until 150 within this course of about a few weeks i've been reading a little bit each day give or take and I can say that season four is going to be amazing. And I can definitely confirm that episode one and two, whoo, that don't, th those draws are about to be a doozy. But more importantly, I do want to talk a little bit about Overhaul and Mirio. All I want to say about these characters is that their stories, their backstories, and their abilities are all truly amazing. And we did get to see a little bit of what Togata was all about and, the, and all the hard work that he actually put into mastering his quirk and really becoming what we learn in the manga that he was actually... Well, actually, you know what? I'm not going to say that because that would be going too much. But what I will say is that there is a lot of backstory covered there's a lot of explanations involved and there's a lot of turmoil that takes place especially on the overhaul side but as far as togata is concerned my man mirio is literally like one of those characters that he's not just a happy face he's not just kind of some kind of all might rip off just know that we're in good hands and horikoshi sama is doing a wonderful job making this story that much better and as far as overhaul goes i'm sure that if you guys didn't already know dobby is one of my favorite villains right now just because i have a thing for blue fire and i like his design a lot and i also do main him in my hero academia wants justice but let me tell you something overhaul is probably going to be like my runner-up next top villain of all time just for the fact that how his quirk works and what he's done with his quirk and what he's planning to do with his quirk and not to mention this dude's trying to single-handedly revive the yakuza on his own so like i said i'm not trying to go into it too much because if the more i talk about it the more chance that i have of actually revealing any kind of potential spoilers for you guys however if you guys do want me to spoil anything and you guys want me to do more in-depth chapter discussions in batches because like doing like a discussion like after every chapter is kind of silly if you're doing a binge read i feel like it's better to talk about the section so that way you have like more than just like you know one chapter to talk about but then then again it's like i do plan on doing something like that with like dragon ball super manga and boruto manga since they only do come out like once a month anyway but again let me know what you guys thought about all of this so far and trust me when i say this season four is definitely going to be one of the best seasons that we get when the manga hits this spring coming up so again as always guys thanks for watching hope you guys enjoyed this please like share subscribe if you have not already leave a comment below let me know what you guys thought about this by hitting up me up on twitter let me know what you guys thought about it in the discord especially on discord if you want to support the channel a little bit more obviously go ahead please consider checking out my patreon today and if you do want to catch up on the my hero academia anime you want to see how the dub sounds which is actually i can vouch for it is very good please click the link in the description below so you guys can go ahead and make yourselves a free funimation now account have a little free trial courtesy of your boy because funimation is a proud sponsor of uchi games as always take care of yourself have a good day may the power protect you and i'll see y'all next time